All right, September the 3rd. So time to go harvest some of the garden. The garden didn't really grow very good this year. Last year was a good year. This year, not so much. Planted the garden in early June, and then for three weeks it was uh, wet and cold. So I think that was a, a bad start. And then it got really hot and, and a lot of thunderstorms, and I, I don't know. But at the end result is everything is late and didn't grow very well. It's just one of those things. You have good years and you have bad years. Just the way it goes. So let's check it out. All right, so these are the potatoes. So what we have here is uh, some red Pontiacs. And they were, they should be ready now. Here we have russets and they're a late potato, so I'm not going to bother harvesting those until probably later in September. So let's go ahead and pull out some of these red Pontiacs and see what we have. Ah. Uh, there you go. A few potatoes. There you go. That's not bad, but definitely smaller than, and not as many as what you probably should have. Just pretty much five small potatoes. And over here we have the, uh, the green beans. Uh, these grew, uh, but they, they came late. Now these were supposed to be ready July 25th and well you know here it is September the 3rd and, and you know I'm just I'm just really just getting them now so that's uh those are pretty late I'll pick some more of those in a bit these are the uh these are my carrots. So carrots were supposed to be ready August the 10th, again, about a month behind. Hang on, pull that out. Eh, not bad. Not bad, not bad at all. Oh, there's a nice one. But again, a month behind. So, and over here we have the green peppers. Six plants and not one green pepper. <laughs> Didn't do well. They should have been ready August the 10th. Let's go over here. Uh, see what we have down here. The onions. Mm, Spanish onions. Supposed to be ready September the 10th. They're a bit behind. And... They're really not doing all that well. They're still pretty small and puny. Oh well. Let's go up here. Uh, my sole cucumber plant. I planted six, only one survived, and I only had one cucumber off of that, and that was it. Squash. Squash isn't supposed to be ready for a couple of weeks, but I'm not sure that it's... I think it's a few weeks behind as well. Here we have my my red chili peppers. These are supposed to be ready August the 20th. They're coming. They're nice. They're big. But they're not red yet. Hopefully, I'll still get those. And... Finally over here my my tomatoes. These are bell tomatoes. They were supposed to be ready July 30th and I only got a couple of couple of tomatoes. All of them are green and there's one there that's a bit orange, but really 
tons of green ones still, but I don't know. I don't know if I'll get anything or not. Now let's look over here. The grapes. Oh, here we go. Here's some grapes. Grapes are starting to come, starting to turn purple. Looking good, looking good. And some apples, got several apple trees. This one uh, usually produces the best apples. These are just wild apples. And man, they are good. They should be ready. They'll probably be ready in two or three weeks, I would hope. They're looking pretty good. Yeah, that's a nice apple tree. The berry bushes didn't produce this year either. So, so there you go, guys. Uh, that's my garden for 2016. Not a fantastic year, but uh, I'll harvest some good vegetables and you know I'll try again next year and hopefully we have a better season. Well, there we go guys nice little harvest should keep me going for a few days and uh, I'll get some more I'll harvest some more next time and maybe in a few weeks till up the garden and and uh, call it a year and nothing goes to waste here at the cabin everything left over goes into the compost next year that'll feed the garden Yeah, man. Wow. Look at that right there. Fresh steamed veggies right out of the garden. Oh, that's going to be good.